Thank you. Asante, asante, asante. Migori hoye. Jo migori untie. Jo migori untie. Asante ni sana. Anuad wa malwa. Anuad karachuonyo. Anuad agoglo. Mimi nimesomea hapa karachuonyo. Gendia high school. Kwa hivyo nikija nyanza nimekuja nyumbani. Na leo nimekuja nyumbani na baba. Na tumekuja na wenzangu hawa. Na vile baba amesema kuna principals wengine. Hawa kuweza kuja siku ya leo. Akiwemo mama Martha Karua. ametuma salamu. Mepokea. Akiwemo ndugu yetu. Um, uh, uh, Peter Munya wa PNU ametuma salamu mepokea Akiwemo ndugu wetu Jeremiah Kioni wa Jubilee ametuma salamu mepokea Akiwemo ndugu yangu Oparanya kutoka Western mepokea Akiwemo wajakoya <laughs> Yeye yeah, yeah. Yeye leo ako kule Amerika. Alikuwa ameenda kusalimia Obama. Na akiwa uko na Obama akasema nileta salamu zake. Mmepokea? Kwanza tuko hapa kusema Oh yes. Hey. <laughs> na pia kule London rafiki wa baba Uhuru Mwigai Kenyatta <laughs> Na ujue Uhuru amesema yeye na baba hadi mwisho. Sawa sawa. So watu wa Migori tuko hapa kwanza kusema asante kwenu. Sababu tulikuja hapa wakati tunaanza maandamano. Ngoma ya maandamano ilianzia hapa Migori. Na vile baba amesema hapa migori ukiangalia zile waya za stima kuna ile low voltage na kuna ile high voltage. Haki ya Mungu migori nyinyi ni high voltage man. <laughs> nyinyi ndio umefanya watu wa migori vile maandamano ilianza hapa ikashika Kenya yote. Wanasema anayekudharau Siku moja hata kusalimia kwa heshima. Yule bwana Gachieda si anadharau baba. Alikuwa anasema eti yeye anaogopa baba sana. Ati sababu ati baba akikusalimia kichwa yako akia mungi naruka. <laughs> Sasa juzi tukiwa katika KICC. Yule anayedharau baba Anasema huyo mzee wa vitenda wili. Anasema huyo mganga yeye ndiye alikuwa amesimama hapo kukaribisha baba akasema karibu your excellency sir. Sasa leo tumerudi migori. Tukisema pole kwenu sababu kuna vijana wetu waliumizwa hapa. Tunasema pia hongera kwenu wana migori sababu yenu tuko mezani boma sasa tunaongea leo tumesema wiki hii imekuwa wiki ya mazungumzo tumekuwa na international dialogue about climate change in the republic of kenya and in the entire world na ile support tumepeana for the international dialogue represented by baba akiwa huko na marais wenzake sisi tunataka next week after international dialogue we want to go back to our national dialogue twajua ya kwamba mabadiliko ya anga ni muhimu sio tu kwa Kenya kwa dunia nzima lakini vile vile the national dialogue that we are having is as important as the dialogue on climate change Mambo ya gharama ya maisha inaguza kila mkenya hapa. Sisi tumesikia 
Bwana Ruto akisema itikifika mwezi wa Septemba wana boda boda hamtaumia na mafuta tena ataletea pikipiki za stima. <laughs> leo Leo nikiwa Migori Migori muko na boda 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 muko Mumepata pikipiki ya stima hapa Migori Nimeona eti wamefungua kampuni ati watatengeneza 10000 Kenya iko na wana boda boda karibu milioni tatu sasa wewe ukianza kuleta pikipiki elfu kumi. itakuchukua miaka kadhaa ndio uweze kuleta pikipiki milioni tatu. Lakini sisi tumesema afanye kitu rahisi kabisa ashukishe bei ya mafuta. Sawa sawa? Ashukishe bei ya unga. Sawa sawa? Stima ifanye nini? Ishuke. Hayo ndio mambo tu, tu tunaongea kule Bomas. And the agenda ile tumeweka ya gharama ya maisha Baba ametutuma kule na Kalonzo na Bwana Kioni. Sisi tunaweka mambo yenu wananchi mbele. Number one ni gharama ya maisha ifanye nini? Vile vile mambo ya demokrasia yetu. Mambo ya IEBC tumesema electoral justice. The issue of electoral justice is as important as the issue of climate change. We want next week as we move from the international dialogue on climate change We want to go back to our national dialogue on electoral justice. Ndugu yangu, Senator Wambua amesema mambo ni matatu. Lakini mimi nasema mambo ni matatu sababu kama Ruto anataka tumtambue jambo la kwanza afungue nini? Jambo la pili afungue nini? Jambo la tatu afungue nini? Hilo ndio litafungua kila kitu ili tujue vile Kenya itaenda mbele. Sawa sawa? Lakini vile Wairia amesema mambo haya yakishindikana hali yanga inaweza ikabadilika. Si Wairia amesema That is why we are saying next week as we go back to our national dialogue we want to see the same support and focus we gave to the international dialogue iwe given to the national dialogue. Wale ambao wanasema ati hapo boma sakuna kitu tatokea. The naysayers I want to say to them and one of them is Gashieda. Yeye siku za Yesu kule Nazareth waliuliza can anything good come out of Nazareth? Yeye ndio ako anasema nothing good can come out of Bomas. Nataka nimkumbushe bwana Gashieda. Out of Bomas was born devolution. Out of Bomas we gave Kenyans one of the most progressive constitutions. And I believe out of bombers tutakuja na mabadiliko katika taifa letu. Hatutaki wale watu waliona ule ugonjwa sababu niliona Gashela anaogopa Raila sana. Na ukiwa na uoga sana kuna ile malaria inaitwa Railaphobia. Sasa huyu jamaa tangu asalimie Raila wiki hii nimeona kidogo ameshika na ugonjwa wa Railaphobia. <laughs> Malaria imemshika ameanza kufanya nini? Kutetemeka. Tunataka kukwambia bwana Gashela and all the naysayers do not let railophobia interfere with our talks at Bomas. Give the dialogue at Bomas support because it holds the key to a peaceful Kenya. It holds the key to an equal Kenya. It holds the key to a stable Kenya. Tuko pamoja jamani? Mwisho nataka niseme yale baba amesema juu ya ODM. A strong ODM is a strong azimio. Na sisi tunataka vile wanasema ukarimu uanzia wapi? Ukarimu uanzia nyumbani. Sawa sawa? Vile vile nidhamu inaanzia wapi? Tungependa kuona na nashukuru sana gavana wenu chila yako. Huyu gavana amekuwa steady nyuma ya baba. Tunashukuru sana Senator Edi. Senator Edi amekuwa steady nyuma ya baba. Tunashukuru sana Fatuma Full Network. Yeye ni full network nyuma ya baba. Tunashukuru sana uh, 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 mbunge wetu Odege. Tunashukuru mbunge wetu Wilson ambaye yako hapa. Wako steady nyuma ya nani? Ya baba. Lakini wale wanasaliti baba, mnawajua si ndio? Waambie chuma chao kimotoni. Tuko pamoja. Tuko hapa na rafiki wa baba kutoka Muranga anaitwa 
kama wa raira akuja wasalimu kwa dakika moja tafadhali tafadhali tuendelee tusiendelee wacha huyu aje awasalimu alafu baba rudi tuweze kuendesha kipindi